first time of coming to FCDC and they are standing here to testify why can't you celebrate God <laughs> celebrate God Almighty hallelujah sir thanks for coming out please tell us your name and where you're from I greet everybody in Jesus name amen my name is Mr. Emmanuel Agbeshoma I'm from JC YouTube West local government and I reside in uh, Urumaro here. Can you celebrate God Almighty? This man standing here is a bunch of testimony. Uh, before I continue, okay. like what one of our mama said, uh, I just want everybody to be calm. Please don't laugh me. Because the testimony looks so funny. That's why I'm appealing to everybody. Praise God. Now, there's a, a daughter. My daughter came to me last week. He said, Daddy, what is happening? I said, I'm not feeling fine. No. Ah, is there a sickness back again? I said, see how I see I'm So I lie down in the chair. Now she told me that's a church. Her church is uh, located in this area that I should come to see the man of God. And when I see the man of God, everything will be okay. I said, all right. I promised to come on Tuesday. I could not be able to come because of my job. So I have to come on Wednesday. I met the man of God. In the castle grand there he told me everything that i should join the prayer section that's going to put me for five days that i have to obey and i came on wednesday i came on thursday that is the day of uh, the covenant the blood commanding uh, the blood uh, command the blood so after the commanding of the blood what he told me i did everything and there's something he told me during the counseling he said uh, Where's my senior son? I say it's in the village. That the battle is so strong. And I am going to re, uh, I'm going to relocate to the village to join my son over there. And uh, they are going to seize my manhood that I cannot be able to make love with my wife again. And this will break up the marriage. And I told him that is the truth. Can you celebrate prophets in the house? There is a reason why I'm calling him now. Because the testimonies you are about to hear is a mind-blowing one. He came on Tuesday, we were unable to come. Yes. On Wednesday, okay. you met with the man of God one-on-one. Yes. On one, yes. And he prophesied to you without telling him anything about yourself. No. Sir, so can you tell us, how are things been with your, your son in the village? I, my son is okay there. Not but he's in the village. It's in the village. He resides in the village. Yes. And the man of God told you that he's seen you going to the going village. To the, I will pack to the village to join my son there. So uh, have you been having this thought or how have things been with you in the city here? Now, after he, he told me all these things, he, he gave me the, the covenant, the, all okay. these things, and I came here to the lie package, down. The package, yes. The package. I came here to pray for the first day, the second day. During, and I could not be able to make love with my wife before. This is almost to scatter the marriage. Praise God. He's, he's, he's over excited. I want us to listen to the testimony very well. Because it's a mind-blowing one. After the prophecy of the man of God. So are you telling us that what the man of God told you is true? It's true. So celebrate the prophecy in the house. <laughs> and he got the package. He started, he joined the assignment that Wednesday. Please look at the audience. He joined the assignment that same Wednesday. And he said, not even the manhood issue, that he has been sick. You told us about your health issue? Yes, what has I, been happening to you about your health, concerning uh, your health? My head, every time I fever, 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 and the manhood is still there too, it doesn't work. For over uh, two, let me say uh, two months now, I could not be able to do anything. So we were just there, and my wife was complaining, the marriage was about able to scatter. And so I, that exact word that the man of God told him, that the marriage is about to break. And now the wife is even complaining. For two months, he has not come close to the wife. His health issues, someone that is sick, can that person touch a woman? like what our sister said and on his own he knows that he has issue with his manhood 
and fever also was there. He has been treating it all to no avail. Then a covenant daughter, a covenant sister, celebrates our sister in the house. God will use you to deliver someone in Jesus' name. She got to the house and said, I don't have anything to do. I don't have anything to give to you. Follow me to my church. Someone said, follow me to my church. And they came. The man of God met with him one on one. And he prayed for him. Watch her scream. This is the day he came. This is one on one with the man of God. Hallelujah. Okay. After that, the man of God asked him to join the prayer section, which he obeyed. Obedience is better than what? Sacrifice. Now, sir, in course of this program, as you were doing this program, because today is the last day of the program. Yes. So what has God of FCDC done for you within the week? All right. I may not, I may not be able to say everything, but I'm going to say a few of it. On that very first day, I tried. There was no way. The second there was no way. Then the, the, the blood uh, commanded, commanded the blood. Commanded the blood. Mm. After taking it, I, I went home and my wife saw me. He said, ah, your body is looking flesh now. Okay. Ah, you are getting okay. I said, hey, is that so? Then we laughed. After uh, 12 minutes, I, uh, I did everything he asked me to do. And everything was flowing. Praise the Lord. God. Do you understand? Do you understand? Uh, he's, he's doing it one time. Let me explain. Let me explain very well. You know, it, okay, say it. Uh, let's hear you. The way, the way God did it for you, okay? Now... God did this. God do so much for me. If whether if only that one, I'm even okay. He said something. Listen. Please, hold on, hold on. Allow the man to talk. The man came. I never met him before. So I told him that this sickness has affected his manhood, and now his manhood cannot work. That see, man, I won't run. Leave him. Oh, problem the house. And the man is telling you that now he's uh, he can now. He's a star now. So go ahead. Yes, tell us what happened. Now, if I, if I God have did it all. The first day I met with my wife after this uh, covenant, uh, commanded the blood, commanded blood uh, everything flowed well. And I could not be able to do before. And yesterday night, please, so I have, uh, right forgive down, me. Sir. I called my woman. The tea flow two times. Ah! He has Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You know, I want to say something in course of interview. He said the first day after they commanded the blood, when he get, got home, the wife was admiring him. That is the first miracle was admiring him that oh, my husband you've changed Joe. Oh, you are looking fresh and it was not so before can you celebrate god of fcdc yeah. then he said something again that after his midnight prayer 12 a.m in the morning he called his wife say oh yeah now he told us something that was yesterday he said for more than three hours Sir, am I correct? Yes, yes. Tell us, sir. Yes. But at three hours, we were shooting. Celebrate God of FCDC. And yesterday again, God did it. Oh, this God is so wonderful. For a man like this to tell you, it's not easy to come out and share this kind of testimony. It shows that he's grateful to God. And God of FCDC that have done this one, he will do much more in Jesus' name. Amen. So how is your wife now? How is she taking care uh, of you? Yeah, uh, we are okay. We are okay. We She's no longer this. like I want to leave. No, 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 nothing like that. Okay. Uh, so. What the devil wanted to do? Yesterday when I got to my phone rang, my sister called me from Sabah that we have a, a, a family meeting in, in JC. I said, 
I'm coming, but I cannot come now. I will finish my service first before I will come. Because that one now will not weigh me down. That will make me not to testify what God has done uh, for me. And after the service, before I will go, I join them. So I wanted to meet up with my God and so that everything, all the whole package, will be packaged on me. Celebrate this God. He's a grateful son. Indeed, he's grateful to God Almighty. That call was a call of destruction. Just to distract him. I celebrate you, sir. Celebrate God of FCDC. Celebrate God of FCDC. So what advice do you have for viewers all over the world and people seated here listening to you this morning? My advice is this. Number one, to myself, I said, this will be my church. And I will not go to any other church. I have a church here in Wari, eh? but I decided to be, uh, take this church to be my church. Mm. And my advice is that the Bible said, believe your God. Believe your prophet and it shall be established. Mm. So I am believing my God and believing the prophet of this ministry. And everybody should also believe that whatsoever you are looking for will be done unto you. Thank you and God bless. Celebrate him as he goes back to his seat.